name is Brianna Catrice Berry. Interesting fact, I'm named after my father. His name is Brian Keith Berry. I'd like to open up with a quote from my favorite scripture in the Bible. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. Lean not into thine own understanding. In all thine ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thine path. This is a quote that I learned in my, favorite, in my formative years. And since becoming a young adult, this Bible verse has been a source of encouragement in my life journey. Um, the relationship between my father and I has developed the positive attributes that I am most proud of, which is empathy. Um, one of my most positive attributes is the ability to empathize with others. I'm easily able to listen and become more and become selfless in times of crisis. Um, I know this is a self-introduction speech, but I'd like to make things more interesting. How about a game of two truths and a lie? Here are things that are about me, and with your participation from the audience today, can you guys guess, by a show of hands, what's the truth and what's the lie? So recently, last year, I've traveled to Puerto Rico. Last year, the summer of 2016, my family and I traveled um, for a week vacation for pictures, funs, and selfies. Um, I drank alcohol with my parents last year around this time during the vacation to the trip to Puerto Rico. Me and my mom had a couple shots of tequila. Um, also, I'm 21 and I just celebrated my birthday it's on September 7th. Anybody want to guess which one is the lie? The second one? No, the lie is... I'm not 21. I'm 20. My birthday is September 7th, and I'll be 21 this year. A um, couple goals I have for me is graduating in May and transferring to ASU because I'm in their MAP program for criminology and science. Um, I want to stop generational curses in my family um, and the negative influence and actions that we hold together in that affect our lives generation after generation. A um, couple skills I like to gain from this class is speaking in front of people because I get nervous. And the top two fears in the world are public speaking and death. And public speaking is number one. And that's my number one fear. Um, also, a dream of mine is to be financially independent and have my own. I'm not the type of person who wants to depend on anyone, and I've learned that from my father. Um, 